Hey guys, it's Bandit again. Do another video update. Um, I just uh, downloaded a couple more videos of cold starts. Uh, there should be a total of two new cold starts there. Uh, one for my sister's 98 slash 99 neon and then another one for her um, 97 neon. Um, also, I um, have plans to do a cold start on my do uh, Adobe car and um, post that in the near future as well as doing a another cold start up on, on oops sorry um, doing a new uh, cold start up per request of Kevin M he's one of my sus uh, subscribers and I'll be do, p posting a new video on his behalf. Or not on his behalf, I'm sorry, that's the wrong words. Um, as per his request uh, to uh, start the Ford up again. Um, it does need battery, so I'm going to have to buy a battery before I can do it. So it's obviously going to start up uh, pretty good because it's <laughs> going to be a new battery. Um, I'm also wanting to see if I can do a cold start with my dad's Magnum, but, uh, it's plugged in all the time, so I don't think we're going to have too many problems with it. It should start right up, and maybe I'll throw in a, um, cold start on my Pontiac 5 as well. Um, so that's the cold startup plans I have. I also have plans of, um recording some videos of my demo car when I start to um, rebuild it for the... I'm thinking I'm going to put it into the Camberford uh, Derby, uh, Camberford, Ontario. Um, but I'm not too sure yet. Um, what else? Um, I would be uh, showing you little bits and pieces like the aftermath of the Lakefield Fair. Uh, so basically the way it's sitting right now, um, I will also be, uh, showing you, um, what I do to it. Like, I'm going to be trying to pull out the, um, uh, door on the, uh, passenger wheel because it got hit hard there in Lakefield and, um, need to put some sheet metal on that too, something, uh, come think of it and I also gotta do uh, the gas tank um, reason I had to forfeit before was because um, the gas tank had a leak somewhere so I gotta find out where that's coming from and seal it and uh, try and get that taken care of um, that way I don't have to forfeit again um, also I'm gonna be um, doing a couple other things with it. I have to get some more wires because uh, I had to take the wires over the Derby car to put it back in my Ford for some other electrical components there. Um, that the wires originally came from. Um, other than that, yeah, there's just uh, the cold starts, the demolition Derby car video. I'm gonna try and get someone to re start recording my derbies and uh, that way I can start uploading them to my own channel instead of uh, finding them on uh, other people's channels and just putting them in my watch list or in a file of some kind anyways um, and uh, normally to uh, vloggers that uh, I take the videos off of but I'm not like claiming them to be mine they're theirs um, I just have them in a uh, file listed demolition derbies um, but I'm in those videos as well as I think my dad's in the one video if I'm remembering correctly um, and both of them all the videos I have so far in that file is from both Mitlander, uh, is his channel name. I do uh, um, 
encourage you guys to uh, check out his channel if you really enjoy do uh, Demolition Dobies, uh, if you haven't already, as well as Dan Hills. He's another one that likes to record the Ontario Demolition Dobies uh, as well. Um, so go check out both those channels and uh, subscribe to them if you want. Um, free shout out for them anyway. So, um, yeah, uh, other than that, that's pretty much it. Um, and as for uh, you, Kevin M, I will do my best to get that uh, Ford uh, up for another cold start. But I can't promise it's going to be too much of a cold start with the new batteries. <laughs> so don't hold anything against me, okay, Kevin? Um, and you can also, uh, you guys can also go check out his channel. Kevin M is his username on YouTube. Um, subscribe to him as well. Um, yeah, comment, uh, like, share, subscribe. And uh, there'll be more videos to come. Alright, you guys all have a good day now. Alright, bye for now.